Hello everyone and welcome to the second final episode of Freddy. I cut I said final episode of Prestige 2 and I thought that would be confusing. But whatever. I'm gonna get start right into this because if you guys don't know what the challenge is, just watch just watch some watch the video I might upload later. And I couldn't really spend any more blood points. I don't know, at least it won't get me another perk, that is. But we finally got End Fury in some way. <laughs> Which I'm really happy. I wish I had gotten it for Clown, but Clown just didn't want it to happen ever. Uh, level 2 Spear Fury is okay. Enduring level 1 is eh, but it's better than nothing. And then we'll get Hex Ruin. So I'm not going to do that find a match thing. I'm just going to say right away. Oh, uh, well, hold on. First, here's a view of all the perks that I got. If you weren't paying attention to that speeded up version of me picking up everything, well, the, this is the rundown. But if you want to see if I, why I picked a perk over the other perk, you can ask below. But other than that, most of the time, it's just I had to pick a perk. So, uh... Losing my train of thought, here's uh, my build that I'm going to try. Uh, brutal Strength, I'm going to be able to destroy dropped pallets and be able to kick generators 15% faster. Spear Fury, every time I break a pallet, I gain a stack. And at three stacks, uh, the next pallet that gets dropped on my head is destroyed. And this is combined with uh, Enduring, where I recover from stuns by 50%. And uh, these do stack. And then Hex Ruin, they uh, they do gens at a normal rate. They can't go any faster with great skill checks, and they actually regress with good skill checks. So it definitely makes survivors uh, either hunt down the totem or try to power through Ruin, which if you're a good survivor, Ruin means nothing or close to nothing. So uh, here we go. All right, here we go. I think this is like game like four or something. I don't. I'm not. I'm not even keeping track anymore because you just lose so many as Freddy. Like I've been farming with him a lot too, and I mean it's really hard to win as Freddy. But when you do, it's so satisfying. And the only times I win with Freddy is when people don't run Mom, Adrenaline, or D Strike. Those are the only times I win. That just shows you how powerful those perks are. Like, use them against nurses, but get some fucking Freddy. It's, it's just annoying. Okay. Got her sleep, so I'm not gonna bother her anymore. 
I thought I saw someone. Where'd she go? There she is. I'm looking for more people. I think they're probably working in the barn. I'm glad that we're coming in to go check that out. Damn, I thought that leaf was a fault was like a survivor. Man, they don't really feel like doing anything. There we go, I just saw someone go that way. Well Are you not gonna go save? Like Are you serious? <laughs> She disconnected. That's kind of nice. And she disconnected. I guess those were just rage quits. Like, I don't know. Like, I kind of just want to count this game. Because if you rage quit against a Freddy, you're pretty fucking bad. But they didn't look like rage quits, to be honest. A really bad time to do that. I mean, they look like rage quits when uh when there is just like standing still for like two seconds or three seconds but it looked like it looked like they like genuinely disconnected so i don't know
Uh, usually I like being nice to people, but... I mean, I kind of just really want to end the game. <laughs> uh. That's pure fear, you know, so even if there was a pallet here. I'm not sure if I'm going to count this game. Uh, I think it might count as my game that I... That when I, I had an episode where I only had one uh, game for Freddy because it was just such an amazing thing that happened. So I didn't really feel like doing another game and also... It was me just getting done farming a million blood points, and then recording all those videos, like... So, uh, I'll just count this as one of those games, and I'll just play, like, two more games, it'll be fine. There we go, this is like game number like six or something. I can, I've lost track, I'm sorry. Freddy's a pretty hard killer to master, to, for sure. I tried the technique of just like dreaming somebody and then just leaving them, but they'll just either blow up on a gen or find someone. Preferably if they find someone, that means they can get two people right away. More often than not, they'll just blow up a gen. So far, I see no work on any gens. He probably got that. Why he's committing so hard? Oh, never mind. I heard that, so I was able to... Sorry, I'm really concentrated because I really want to win the game for once. Like, legitimately. So that last game, which I've decided to put up, I think. That last game was just the uh, two people DCing. Okay. Sorry, dude. That you just got tunneled, but... It is kind of your fault for going after Ruin right after you're injured. You should have just waited till you healed or something. Okay. 
Just keep her injured, it's fine. Is no one really gonna go save him? There you go. Go after the case. I don't like the tunnel, but it just happens. Okay. You guys are using pallets really unop unoptimally. Optimally, that's what I meant to say. Goddamn. But the next pallet I could just break for free. If they slam it on me, of course, and my stun reduction will help kind of a lot. And also that. I think I just saw him over here. Which is a sad days for him. Yep. I mean, it sucks, but if I was him and like I got like caught twice in a row like that, I'd hide the fuck out of the game, dude. Like, uh, the reason why I do that is so I can still be in the game and still be of some help. Like, I'd rather hide and wait for someone else to get chased in some way. Like, if they take a hit or something. That means it's more time that I'm allowed to be in the game. Well done. I should have kicked it, but I got a free hit there, so... And I could probably get her down, too, because there's, like, hardly any pallets left. Don't mind at all. Where'd she go? She kept running, didn't she? Yeah, she did. You're here up here too? Are you gonna save right in front of me? I mean, I don't mind going after new people, it's just, uh... When I can get people dead, I'd rather just get people dead. They're healing up there. I, sh I could've- I was thinking about not picking them up, but... I just decided not to. I'm already so far ahead, it's kind of ridiculous. They tried like being sneaky, and they were. See you going for him, dude. I know exactly where that Jane is, too. Okay, that uh, Ace gave up. 
But keep in mind, I'm not even camping. Like, I go after people, if, but if I see people go for an unhook, I'm gonna go after them too. I'm not gonna, like, just give people free unhooks. I mean, this is kind of stupid. Man, they both have self care. Damn, she got me with that. But she's eventually dead, so it doesn't really matter. I got a built-in deer stalker with my power now. So I can see where that Jane is no matter what. I mean, you could probably call me a tunneler. Because I tunneled that uh, first guy pretty hard. But... After that, like, I left him alone, but then he was right there in front of me when I hooked another person. I don't know what to do after that. And not to mention, like, uh... I couldn't camp that guy over there, because I'm Freddy. I, I can't camp unless I have everyone dreamed, and... Even then, if I see you going to save someone, I'm gonna stop you. I'm not just gonna let you have it. I let them have it over there because they're one they were too far away. And I didn't really feel like it at the time. Probably would have been more optimal for me to go after them, but I didn't. Get a bunch of brutality points, I guess. I know there's a pallet over there, and they're all they're struggling pretty hard, so I'll be able to farm all these gens and pallets while I wait. Yeah, there's a pallet right here. Man, they worked on like no generators. <laughs> I. Does this one even touch? Nope. This one was touched at the beginning of the game, but then I kicked it. This one probably was not touched. That one was probably not touched. That one was touched and that one was touched. Oh no, that one was touched! Huh. Okay then. God, that sucks right there. Well, he he fucking tunneled. I tunneled. I just I was forced to. Like I I'm not gonna let an injured person just go just because they've been like they're on death hook in like two minutes of the game. That's technically it's not my fault. Well, actually it is my fault because I'm the I'm the killer. I purposely you know try to kill people. It's just he could have done a better job at hiding. I I'm not just gonna let him go. I'm sorry. All right, here we go. Uh, all right, this has been a, it's been quite a day. I've been recording for almost an hour and thirty minutes, and uh, I've almost found enough blood points. Where if I get six hundred k, I'll probably be at a million. I mean, I'm at one hundred twenty k right now, but I kind of think this game's gonna be a bust too. I don't know why. If it's not, then I'm gonna look silly. But whatever. Oh, was that sprint first? I was wondering why he was just like standing still. Yeah, I'm gonna go after this guy instead. The more people I dream, the better for me.
Did I redeem this guy? Yeah, I did. Okay, I'm gonna avoid it in time. I've never seen a fast vault grab, and I've people told me that that's possible, but I've never seen it. Okay, one person healed. So I got a hook for like a pallet with no gen progress so far, and my ruins gone, so. There goes my buddy in life. Oh, is that the one there? Never mind. I only just got saved. I don't feel like tunneling. There's more ammo that people will use against you. I thought someone would be here, because that gen was pretty close to being done. I mean, it's like halfway, maybe a little bit under halfway, but to me that's pretty close. I know there's two people over here, so that's two people that I can dream put in dream state, which is pretty nice. There I go. You're not gonna make any of those. Uh, sorry, dude. I didn't really feel like tunneling, but it happens. Kate wanted to sprint out to the into non-existence. I heard someone over here. Oh. Okay. You're gonna use this loop, I guess? Jeff? What? It? Nice throw down. I was not gonna save that guy. Why would I want to get pallets done? If you're gonna give me a free hit, I'd rather take that.
I didn't. Uh, uh. Nice. I mean, that, that dude I definitely tunneled, I'm not gonna lie. I wasn't even pressured to either, I feel kinda bad. Flashlight flying that time? Okay. They split the gins evenly, which is amazing for them. Which is amazing for them. Wait, did they? I don't think they did. No, they didn't. There's three gins over here. I want to protect these gins. Fuck you guys. I think I just saw a crow pop up over there. So you're definitely not going to make it to him in time. Come on, throw it down. Good job. I literally could not hit you during that time, and he threw it down anyway. Nah, I'm not gonna bother. I mean, I'm just ensuring he's dead. Even though I really can't actually ensure he's dead. <laughs> Hey, not my fault you guys didn't save him in time. I'm literally Freddy, as in like... I'm 7 second Freddy, I have no add-ons. To help me camp. Uh, you guys just didn't make it in time. All your fault. Alright. Who's definitely working on this. Or she was. He has to be hiding, yep. Just kick it just for luck. See, like, when I'm not facing, like, moms and shit, uh, I do pretty good. It's, a, it's especially mom that's bothering me. Adrenaline bothers me a little bit. Because this is... Basically, it's just adrenaline. And I didn't get D-Strike because obviously there's no obsession. Since there's no obsession, there's no mom or D-Strike. But this is how well I play without those perks. I want to make sure she doesn't Kobe. Okay. I didn't want to hit that cape back there, because uh, this guy could easily uh, go to the hooks to save, and I could have stopped him. Uh, GG. Now, the reason why I didn't want to hit the cape also was because she could self-heal and get out of her uh, dream state. So instead she had to blow up a gen, and... Jeff had to choose between doing a gen or going to save, and I assumed he was just going to go save, which he did. But I couldn't even stop it, and he didn't even make it in time. So it was silly of me to try to stop it, but at the same time, my presence scared him enough probably to not save. He 
Easy, well played. I doubt they'll say anything. Usually when I'm recording, I get proven wrong so many times. <laughs> like, they're like, ah, oh, you're actually a really nice killer. So, like, I, I've had that happen so many times. <laughs> I'm just like, oh, goddamn, I didn't expect nice survivors. But, you know, let's uh, get on to the... Actually, not get on to the next game. This was the final game. This was the third game because I missed a game in one of my previous episodes. So the final episode's coming up right back to back because of... I'm going to buy my Air Edition shards, and I'm pretty sure I'll have enough to level up to 50, so see you then.